The young man sees his beloved coming and he's looking for every opportunity to, to catch a glimpse of her, looking through the lattices, looking through whatever he can find to, just so he gets a clear vision. And I guess in many ways that's kind of young love, right? It's uh, you're just infatuated with each other and that you truly want to just be with each other, spend time with each other, get to know each other. I remember probably the second or third date that you guys were gonna go on and he was at the table trying to Google places to take you and things to do. It was just something in the way that he did it that I just knew, you know, this was different. I was just happy that he found somebody that he can be really happy with. Lauren Gerardo's relationship grow. I've seen how Gerardo's presence has this magical, calming effect on Laura, where her worries just seem to melt away when he is near. And I've seen how Laura, who has always rigidly despised all forms of sports and video games throughout her life, will now tolerate those two things, if only because they make Gerardo happy. Those long talks, those late nights, spent staring. Relationship is one built out of respect, honesty, and true friendship. And when you watch them together, you'll see the way that they interact so fluidly, genuinely, and humorously. So the day after Laura and Gerardo had their first date, I was waiting by the phone for her to call. Despite my prodding, she didn't want to share too much of the night with me, but I could tell that she was smiling while she spoke. And I remember how she told me that she felt like, after just one date, she already knew Gerardo, how it felt like they were already friends, and how they had just clicked. Laura received this ring as a sign of my love, as a sign of my love, as a sign of my fidelity, as a sign of my fidelity, in the name of the Father, in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, and of the Holy Spirit. Gerardo received this ring 
pleasure in receiving this ring. As a sign of my love. As a sign of my love. As a sign of my fidelity. As a sign of my fidelity. In the name of the Father. In the name of the Father. And of the Son. And of the Son. And of the Holy Spirit. And of the Holy Spirit. It gives me great pleasure, great joy, and honor to present to you this newly married couple, Mr. and Mrs. Gerardo Lutigliano. Laura and I lived together, along with these two lovely ladies on my right, and one day I came home from class, hoping to make myself lunch, only to see that the one pot that we had was sitting in the sink, stewing in a saucy, soapy mess. I knew by the Italian red sauce dripping down the sides of the pot that the culprit was Laura. I confronted her and said, that pot in the sink is disgusting and I am not cleaning that. And just like that, after eight years of peaceful friendship, we were having our first fight. Over the years, I've seen these two bicker incessantly and sometimes fiercely, but only to see them forgive and forget within hours. Uh, they fully value and appreciate the love they have fostered and have worked tirelessly to build and maintain, and I'm so grateful to have seen it grow from the tiniest of seeds into a beautiful garden that will only gain rows upon rows of smiles, memories, and joy abounding.
Love cannot function without selflessness and strong wills. It is the daily actions of the individual that foster any relationship. And if you watch the way that they look at each other, you'll spot a certain look. They look at each other with love. And it's a look that I'm confident is going to last a lifetime. take this opportunity to welcome uh, the Rutilianos in, in our world. Also, um, enjoy the grounds. Uh, Montebello is a, is a beautiful place tonight. that today, right now, in this moment, things are as they should be. The most amazing person I've ever known has truly found her match. You two are perfect together. Your relationship brings sparks of energy and adventure every single day. May this day be only the beginning of a great romance, and may those sparks continue to fly.